You know, yeah. you may be leaving us here at Channel 3, but you are certainly, do not worry at home, he will be at those Browns games on the radio. And three people you have spent a lot of time oh, with over the years. Join right. us, Mary Kay Yay. Connick, Tony Grossi, and Jason Lloyd. Thank you all for being here. Hey, there you go. <laughs> Anthony. Jason. Hi, nice to see you. <laughs> Good to see you. Welcome in. Thank you so much for being here. I know it means so much to you. It does. Gosh, my gosh. We've done a lot of shows together. We've gone through winless seasons and better seasons, right? I've said, yeah, I've said this is like the series finale to MASH. <laughs> <laughs> Probably a little bigger viewership than that, right? We had a great time. I mean, uh, you know, Tony uh, was part of a, a show that we kind of christened here called The Point After. Uh, and it was a it was a heavy opinion show. And uh, we had Sam Ritigliano with us and Doug was with us. And Jason and Mary Kay have been with us on Monday nights and doing every kind of show. Mm -hmm. And it's been great. It's I been mean, because the Browns are... The hot topic, aren't they? Absolutely. Everywhere I go, Jimmy, it's funny. I could write five stories in one day, and all anybody ever says to me when I'm out is, I see you on Monday nights with Jimmy Donovan. <laughs> Jimmy's so great. So thank you for letting me ride uh, your coat today. Absolutely. You're pretty good it. on the show. I, I feel like I'm cheating. You bring an opinion. Well, I missed like 0-16 oh, and 1-15. And and <laughs> I was off doing the NBA for that. So I came in when like the Browns were watchable. Yeah. So I feel like I, I'm like, don't belong here. You know, we had uh, Bernie on right at the beginning yes. of the show, and I, I was saying to him, and, and you guys, we were all together covering the Browns then, what a magical time that was, yes. and how we reach for that right now, but that was just unbelievable. My favorite story, memory of you, you know, we, we, we have our own haunts across the league <laughs> over sure. the years, and the Browns were playing in Indianapolis, and one of our favorite <laughs> Italian restaurants, Iorias, is there. <laughs> And a lot of Browns fans happened to be there that night. And I walk in with Jimmy, and there's a standing ovation. <laughs> we didn't say, he didn't say a word. He just walked in, and people are applauding. We even got a few drinks that night. <laughs> One time, he, we had a reservation, and that particular restaurant was closing very soon. And he's, uh, you know, calling me and saying, where are you? And I, I didn't. I don't know how to Uber or anything like that. So I, <laughs> I hired a guy on one of those bikes. <laughs> the over. chariot. Honestly, I went over on one of I'm those crying. Bikes. I'm not surprised. All well, the memories you guys have, I'm sure, are endless. Uh, and there's more to come. Yes. Uh, and, absolutely. And, and then we had the crazy Johnny Manziel years. I yeah. saw Josh Gordon yesterday. He said to say hi. So I'm at the softball. <laughs> you were one of his favorites. Oh, he said. thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. But we look forward to the football time. And we spend a lot of time together for six, seven months a year. You know, it's just great. And the bond is there, and we, we appreciate you guys for being here. Thank you so much. Thanks for inviting us. Oh, well, of it's course. great seeing you all. all right. I'll see you tomorrow. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Literally. Yes.